Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Linux Mint 22 on VMware Workstation. So first download then install it. So go to Linux Mint official website that is linuxmint.com. Hit enter. See here we have the Linux Mint 22. Its name is Wilma. You can click on download or click on download. If you hover mouse on this here, we have the all versions and Linux Mint 22. So click on Linux Mint 22. Then see here, we have the editions like Cinnamon, XFC edition and Mate edition. See, we can download any one, but the installation process is same for all three editions. We are going to download Cinnamon. It is most popular version of Linux Mint. Okay, so click on download. See, its a size is 2.7 gigabytes. If you want to see the installation guide, you have to click on this one. Otherwise, click on scroll down. See here, we have the 64 bit Linux Mint. And see here the location and mirrors. See, we have the different locations and mirror names. So click on the first one or any one, it's fine. Click on first one, that is this one. See, once we click done, download has been started. Go to downloads. See, it's a size is 2.7 gigabytes. Wait until this download completes. But I have already downloaded. See here, I have already downloaded Linux Mint Cinnamon 64 bit ISO file. Okay. In your case, wait until download completes. Once the download is completed, then install VMware on your machine. If you want to install VMware on your machine, then go through the link provided in the video description and install it. We have two types of VMware. VMware Workstation Player and VMware Workstation Pro. VMware Workstation Pro is paid version and VMware Workstation Player is free for non-commercial use. Okay. But the installation process is same. Open VMware. See, I have VMware Workstation Pro and VMware Workstation Player. So, open both. Workstation. See, click on create a new virtual machine. Here also, we have the same create a new virtual machine. Okay. Process is same on both. Okay. So, close this one. See, I have these many virtual machines. So, click on create a new virtual machine. And select. Then here, select the installer disk image file. Click on browse. Then go to the downloads directory. See here, I have the Linux Mint 22 Cinnamon. 64 bit ISO file. Click on open. Then click on next. Select Linux and then select the version as Ubuntu latest one. So select Ubuntu 64 bit. Then click on next. Here provide the name. I am giving Linux Mint 22 VM. Name can be anything. Then select the location to store this virtual machine files and folders. Select the path where you have the NF space. Create a new directory for this one. View the name. Click on OK. See, this is the location for to store this virtual Linux Mint 22 virtual machine files and folders. OK. So, click on Next. Here, provide the disk capacity. I am giving 100 gigabytes. Then, click on Next. This is the summary. Still, if you want to modify any one of them, you have to click on Customize Hardware. If you want to increase the memory, or decrease you have to use this pointer up and down or you can change the value here okay i'm okay with all these settings click on close click on finish see virtual machine is created still if you want to edit any one of these settings select this virtual machine from this menu then click on edit virtual machine settings or right click and select the settings or select this virtual machine and click on vm and select the settings all three options are saved so, if you are okay with all the settings, then click on power on this virtual machine to start the installation of Linux Mint 22 on VMware Workstation. Click on it. Click on the, this screen and use the up and down arrows and select the options like start Linux Mint, start Linux Mint in compatibility mode, OEM install, hardware detection, boot from local drive or memory test. So, select the first one. That is in start Linux Mint and hit enter. See, this is for only testing purpose. 
you can use this for testing purpose but to install permanently you have to click on this install linux mint then right click and click on open select language and click on continue select keyboard layout and click on continue if you want to install multimedia codecs you have to select the check box i don't want so uncheck it and click on continue see this is the fresh, fresh installation so select the erase disk and install linux mint so click on install now confirm continue select the location from this globe or search here okay so if you are from us you have to select here if you are from uk you can select here if you are from australia you have to select i am from india so i am selecting kolkata so click on continue now provide the username so i am giving username as after schools this is the full name and this is the computer name or host name i am ln mnt 22 later also we can change this computer's name a host name and this is the username then provide the password keep this checkbox that is require my password to login and click on continue see installation has been started this may take time so i'm pausing this video until this installation completes See, installation is completed, so click on restart now. Before click on restart now, we have to remove the ISO file. Right click on this virtual machine, then settings, then CD, DVD, then uncheck these two. Then click on OK. Click on S. Now click on restart now. Now provide the password and hit enter to get full screen you have to click on this enter full screen mode. Close this one. See before here we have the install Linux Mint 22 but now it is not there. Now go to terminal let me increase the font edit preferences custom font. Okay. See now font has been increased. Now verify more slash etc os hyphen release. See we have installed Linux Mint 22. Its name is Wilma. Okay. If you want to verify the IP of this machine, IF config. See this is the IP of this Linux Mint 22 virtual machine. So in this video, we have seen how to download and install. Linux Mint 22 on VMware Workstation in Windows environment. For more Linux Mint or Linux videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.